What if I told you there was a whole new category of rides you could put in Roller Coaster Tycoon 2? Rides you may never have seen before. Well, in this video, I'm going to tell you all about it. But first, I have a challenge and I'm kind of scared. So I've been wanting to schedule a 12 hour Roller Coaster Tycoon stream, but I need something from you first. I want to try to see if we can get this video to 500 likes. And that's a lot. All you got to do is just scroll down to the bottom of this video player, hit that like button, and that's all I need from you. And if we get to 500 likes, we'll do a 12 hour stream. I really, really want to do this. So please hit that like button real quick and let's get to 500 and get that 12 hour stream. Let's talk custom rides. I used to go to carnivals all the time, like those little pop-up carnivals that would show up in your mall parking lot. And I got so fascinated with all the rides, like getting to see them up close was so cool. You know, rides like the Fun Slide, Kamikaze, Tilt-A-Whirl, Hat Stall. And over the last few months, I've actually been discovering that there are some really cool custom rides for Roller Coaster Tycoon, like these carnival rides that I used to grow up riding. Now in this video, I'm gonna tell you the top 10 that I think you need to put in your park today. So let's get into it right now. All right, let's start with number 10, the swimming pool. This is actually just the boat hire. Um, and the way to get it set up is that you put in your boat hire, change the boat type to swimming pool, and you can use the tile inspector to make the station platform invisible, or you can build a cool you know, building around it. And look at all these peeps, they're swimming. So cool looking. Number nine, skateboards. Gosh, this is one of the most creative custom rides I've ever seen. It's also super simple. It's not anything crazy, but look, they're like skating on these half pipes and they've got like their pads and you can see the helmets and everything. It's so detailed. I usually put these in the middle of a big concrete plaza because it reminds me of an actual skate park. Number eight, Riggs Extreme Tumbler. All right, I wouldn't dare ride this ride in real life because it would make me freaking sick. Uh, but you can't deny that this ride is designed so well. It's such a clean look. The ride goes up and down and flips the guests around. It, it looks so smooth. It's bound to make everyone sick, but it looks like a really cool ride. Number seven, Round It Up. This is a classic carnival ride that I'm sure you've seen before. So you get in what looks like a round cage and it rises up and spins you around. Really fun ride, but also makes you kind of sick. It's a really cool experience, and this design in RCT2 is so sleek. I mean, look at this. It looks so awesome. All right, here it goes. Watch it rise up. Oh my gosh, it's going so fast. Everyone's going to get sick. Guys, get off the ride. Number six, Skydiver. Now, this isn't a ride I've actually ever ridden in real life, but it looks fantastic in the game. It's like a Ferris wheel, basically, but it kind of goes upside down and turns. It's really cool looking. Looks to me like it would be a really fun ride, and it looks so good in the game. All right, number five, The Bouncer. Uh, this is basically, from what I can tell, a bounce house. Uh, guests hop on one of these four bounce pads, and they just jump and jump and jump. It looks so funny when you zoom in. Now, this one does need some scenery around it to make it look really cool. Usually, I'll build a wall around it with like a little border across the top. Look how much fun they're having. Yay! Number four, the swinger. Now tell me you've ridden a classic swings ride like this at a theme park or carnival. I used to love these, they're so much fun. Uh, it's basically a merry-go-round sort of, but you're swinging. Now one thing I wish this design had was swings that would actually swing back and forth. It looks like the little chairs are just stuck on the rotating platform. And so it's not exactly the effect I would want, but I think it's still really cool. And the design is so cool looking. It just looks amazing. And that's why it's so high on my list. Number three, the Tilted Whirl. Oh my gosh. I have so many memories of going to a carnival and hopping on a Tilted Whirl. Now this ride in real life is so fun. You basically sit inside a little car and it spins around while rotating on this platform. Not sure if I could handle this as an adult, I'd probably get real sick, but as a kid, it was amazing. And the detail of this design is so cool. It shows like everything so clear, even like, you know, the little platform, how it's like slanted and curved. Whoever created this one didn't have to go into the detail that they did, but they did it and it's awesome. Number two, the super looper. Okay, I need to admit that I've actually never ridden this in real life. By the time I was brave enough and old enough to try it, I stopped going to carnivals. But I was always so intrigued by the train because you couldn't see inside. It was always so mysterious. 
and the cable that like pulls it around the loop was always so cool. Now this design hits it out of the park. It has every element that the real ride has. Even the cable that pulls the train, you can see it with such detail in the game. And you can't see inside it. It's just perfect and amazing, and it's also perfect, and it's also amazing. And here we go. Number one. My favorite and objectively the best custom ride in Roller Coaster Tycoon is... Drum roll, please. The double swinging inverter ship. Yay! Now, this is commonly called Kamikaze. If you go to a carnival or a fair, you're going to see it called Kamikaze. This was my favorite carnival ride as a kid. And it's my favorite custom ride in Roller Coaster Tycoon 2. This one is perfect. Doesn't really even need words to explain it. It's just so good. It's true to the original ride. Uh, this is actually a really good opportunity on this one to make the entrance and exit invisible and to make it look like a really cool carnival ride. Five stars. 10 out of 10. No, 11 out of 10. No, 12 out of 10. No, 13 out of 10. All right, those were 10 custom rides that you need in your Roller Coaster Tycoon Park. I did want to give away some honorable mentions. These are ones that didn't make the top 10, but you should still check out. Rides like the Star Trooper, Mad Hatter's Teacups, the Double Inversion, the Hay Ride, Super Scan, the Jump Around, the Plane Ride, and Toilets. Thank you for watching, and if you've created one of these rides, thank you. The, the fact that you spent time doing this is incredible. Thank you so much. It's really cool. Now remember to go hit that like button down below so we can get to 500 likes and do a 12 hour roller coaster tycoon stream. Also, do you like The Sims? I hope you do. I hope you do very much. I also make a lot of Sims 1 videos on this YouTube channel. One of the ones I did recently is called The Sims 1 in Real Life. You can watch it right here. Click on it now to go watch. I do some Sims bits. I become a Sim. I talk in Simlish. It's a lot of fun. Uh, so go click over and watch that video next and I hope you have a great rest of your day. Dag, dag.